<laughs> oh, oh, it's just the attack of the Amanto. Whoa, damn, they should have started with that. <laughs> Man, I thought we we're going to have like a, a funny episode. I guess temporary, but man. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> man. After that introduction, the shark in the assassination act, a recap. <laughs> they open with what? <laughs> man. Yeah, it's still Gintama. <laughs> man. Oh. Man, I, I miss Tama. Man, this is... This is a... <laughs> this is war. Guess they could... They will have Takasugi... The Joey Rebels, the Shins the Shinsengumi will definitely come back now. They have to. Damn. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. been watching he's observing everyone oh man it's been so long since he took that uniform oh <laughs> he still have that oh. <laughs> man he's not Madao anymore oh <laughs> <laughs> Man, I miss those days. Man. All Hasegawa episodes have been amazing. Man. <laughs> he doesn't... Oh, of course. Oniwaban. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> well, I think Wado has a plan. <laughs> we should. <have> done <laughs> man, I forgot <laughs> how useless he was when they <laughs> when they did the Kintama episode, Kintama art. But yeah, don't underestimate Wado. <laughs> Man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Man, they ruined <laughs> they ruined this moment. <laughs> but yeah, just wait till the reinforcements arrive. Oh I've been waiting. <laughs> I thought they already. <laughs> I thought they abandoned his character. <laughs> Man. So he did. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I thought that they already totally abandoned his character. That's why we haven't seen him for a while. I guess it makes sense because he's an Amanto. <laughs> Man, Catherine. <laughs> oh, yeah, 
just wait they'll be coming home oh they're here Oh man, I'm getting chased. <laughs> I knew it was coming, but man, their their entrance is still, I guess, try as you might to make. I'm not sure if I'm going. It will always let her. Yeah, I I I knew it was going to happen. Or oh, the intro. And Madao. <laughs> yeah, they just <laughs> they just fought one of the strongest, I guess, pirates, and yeah, they've they've already went through a lot of war. I guess with the Shogun assassination arc, fa farewell Shin Sangumi. <laughs> <laughs> You're destroying. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, gang guy. Yeah, def he, he will definitely be a great part in this war. Because, yeah, I, I remember he. Before he was like a mechanic of the um, Joey War, he was. Yeah, I think that's the first time we they introduced Takasugi. Was that he was creating, like, fighting robots? So definitely he will be helpful in this war, in this fight. Oh yeah, <laughs> man! This is like a culmination of all the different um, people that we've met, I guess, throughout Gintama. Because we had the fight with uh, for the Fordevas are. That involves the Kabuki. Man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they just need to rally be behind Gintoki. <coughs> they are Zuya. Who's that? Oh! <laughs> yeah. Saigo. Who's this Saigo? <laughs> yeah, Saigo. Yeah. Man. Oh, man. I hope we get to see Jirocho. And uh, what was her name? Jirocho's daughter. Man, that would be cool if he also become a part of this. Man, all the fighters. I guess the only remaining strong one would be Jirocho. I guess Saigo is also a veteran. So, man. <laughs> Oh, Sakamoto. <laughs> yeah, he would be <laughs> he would be amazing in Yeah, in in negotiate negotiation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, even cut. Oh, whoa. Oh, yeah, forget about Nobu Nobu. Man, man, but cuts are not working for. <laughs> I guess, I guess they, yeah, they have to unite now and 
Um, I think it's thanks to man. I love this new out this outro. I wonder if there's spoilers. I guess I'll I'll just watch it after. Man, I like the song much better, and the outro. Man, but <laughs> yeah, man. All all I guess I I all of the people that there's a lot that would be definite definitely um essential that could be helpful in I guess winning this war and I guess it's also one way of doing that is I guess through, through di diplomacy and yeah I guess it makes sense that they cannot really fight this um this allied forces of Amanto in an all out war because yeah they are definitely outnumbered and I guess even in weapons resources it would be impossible so I wonder what I guess they they could offer a deal, Nobunobu or maybe Sakamoto, and uh, maybe just focus around Utsuro. So I wonder that if that's the the deal that they are planning to to I guess to make with them. But yeah, total forget about Nobunobu and yeah, um, he he had really a great I guess turn around from that moment when um yeah sakamoto when he was with sakamoto and uh with mutsu and uh, yeah i think it, it they already showed that uh nobu nobu really it as uh, i guess his motivation really still somewhat he still has that somewhat similar desire to lead his people and yeah i'm i'm i guess that's one of the things that um, they somewhat highlighted from him and yeah I think it's also a great way but I don't know I feel like it's too still too early to expect them for this to work out so definitely something something will happen or maybe this is a part of the plan they have a plan on how to I guess maybe disrupt the headquarters or something like that but we'll see and <laughs> when the beginning of this arc i guess in this episode i guess they had the recap of so far what has happened through these serious arcs with um with shige shige Sh shogun assassination arc the farewell shin sengumi and uh and rakuyu arc and, <laughs> and they started with my <laughs> um but yeah it's like a metaphor of what's currently happening with them with struggling and he, he was saying that all those hardships that he had all those unlucky moments was built for him to be tough for <laughs> this day because <laughs> uh yeah but i love that he was like a scout he was like the i guess he's um it's like he's like the the voice of the common people he's the one who's always around um he's always the one who sees everything that's happening within the kabuki district and it's somehow he is he was able to g gather those voices and i guess create like a to represent them in order to i guess to like have a job request to gintoki and i love that it's it's him who we started with him with madao who who was like the one who was who wasn't around but he was like the 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 person that would definitely um cared the most for kabuki even though he he suffered through a lot of things and he was always like suicide <laughs> things like that but um i love that madao has been able to showcase that he's able to do he was able he's able to uh, scrape things and just pick up those coins 100 yen coins and wonder how much he was able to um to save in in order to just finally um put this request to gintoki and i think it's just a, a symbol of um showing how how much um madao represents the common people and how much he also <coughs> loves and i guess also at the same time the suffering that everyone was was having during this attack by the uh, I guess by the arrival of the Amanto. So 
yeah um but so far it's not what i was it's a little bit better than i was expecting i thought that it will just start with them blasting everyone trying to kill everyone and trying to destroy earth that's what that's what i was expecting based on what utsuro was saying and uh so yeah i guess right now they're just looking for the tendoshu and once they finally dealt with that and those because that and those is like the <clears throat> the agency that uh was like yeah they were like the that was controlling the altana reserves but yeah they're now into hiding and definitely they're going to appear eventually and yeah i don't know maybe i think they might have been killed by utsar already because uh i think utsar has already Otsuro's already used them. I think that's the the point when he was Yeah, I think Yeah, maybe I forgot about that about that scene where about when Utsuro was talking about the talking to them about the Altana research. I think he I assume that he already killed the Tendoshu and has he has now full control of the uh, Harusame. I guess not the Harusame but the other remaining um other the the half of the the six squad was it six platoons or squads of the uh, harusame and yeah he's just his his end goal is just to make earth to destroy earth so that finally he would have a, a death that he has been i guess hoping to to experience and to finally put an end to his um his eternal i guess this is eternal suffering or something something like that but but i think deep down he's somewhat expecting that gintoki will be able to stop that and gintoki will find a way um to kill him and um last arc um umibozo was already looking for he did say that there was there's a way to kill um utsuro uh, the other way around instead of destroying earth so i think that uh, will eventually play out i'm assuming next arc because i don't think um i think the next arc will be more about utsuro so maybe this time around this arc will be more focused about them trying to defend the earth from the allied amanto or uh, amanto amanto that has been um i guess looking for revenge but at the same time they're trying to take control over the earth i guess because their planet has been destroyed and yeah also <laughs> one of the surprising things was uh, prince haka hata haka um prince baka and it's been so long <laughs> and uh, since he appeared i thought they totally maybe because fans didn't like his character that they totally abandoned him and um disregarded his character altogether because I don't know maybe han uh, episodes 100 was the last time we saw him so maybe 200 episodes ago since the last time we saw him so it's been so long since he appeared and yeah i think um there must be a reason because uh because <laughs> there was a lot of some a lot of characters that somewhat came back um as well so he was i guess he was the only one we haven't seen for a while and i guess this is now <laughs> the perfect opportunity to include him especially that this is like all the culmination of all the amanto within the universe so yeah i wonder how will this play out this this plan with nobu nobu negotiating with the i guess the the heads of the allied amanto and and yeah, I also forgot to mention about Katsura and Sakamoto's outfit. <laughs> I guess they're like, rep I guess, uh, uh, bodyguards of Nobu Nobu. And man, who would have thought that Katsura would be the one who'd be assist? I guess being being by the side of Nobu Nobu. And yeah, it's all it's all now. Uh, it's everyone is now working together towards. I guess protecting their home yeah it's otherwise it's it's pointless whether what your your um i guess your your your, your what what is your 
um, I guess perspective in terms of government things like that if you don't have the, the planet that they are going going to uh, to live your home so yeah I think that's one of the things that really rallies people towards a common goal if it's is related to their home so yeah that's all I could say in this the action if you'd like to share your thoughts leave a comment down below if you did enjoy watching my reaction please leave a like make sure to subscribe if you want to watch my reaction the next episode right now my full length just go to the link in the description down below you could watch it on my patreon if you decide to support my channels and it will really be able to help uh, support this channel moving forward in the future thank you for watching see you in my next video have a great day goodbye